good morning this is jay kumar uh, now i am going to take a topic about how to in install the xcat before we going to the installation of xcat i'll just define what is xcat and what are the prerequisites to install the xcat on the management node and uh, how we need to configure the yamra 4 then finally how we need to install the uh, xcat okay first thing is definition of xcat yeah this is xcat is the extreme cloud administration toolkit and it offer complete management for hpc cluster renform grid web form online gaming infrastructure cloud data center and whatever to more busy world may be it's a management software for hpc and cluster and uh, this is the management software and what are the kind of services it is providing it is providing provisional operating system for physical and virtual machine uh, with a different operating system distro RHL, CentOS, Fedora, SLES, Ubuntu, AX, Windows, VMware, KVM, PowerVM and ZVM and it has a lot of script which contain to install state and stateless ice case and cloning image and we can remotely manage the compute system and with the light out management remote console and distributed cell support and we can quickly configure the cluster service uh, such as dns http dhcp tftp and nfs and the uh, xcat differentiator xcat scales it's beyond more than 1000 nodes in the distributed architecture and it is a open source developed built by eclipse public license and uh, with the more installation option we can install the hard disk with the run stateless and then diskless with a little bit of state that kind of stuff we can do here and built in automatic discovery no need to power on one machine at a time to discover also node that fail can be replaced and back in action just powering them on there is no need to do everything single this things we can do it and this about the wikipedia xcat information and uh, xcat mean extreme cloud administration toolkit and it is the software developed by the I ibm and uh, remaining everything I have already explained and the second part is uh, to install the xcat on the management uh, here I created one virtual machine that virtual machine uh, contained the 18 GB hard disk and uh, 18 GB hard disk this is the configuration details uh, and 1 GP RAM this kind of stuff I did just I created one virtual machine about uh, the virtual machine I installed the Red Hat operating system RHL 6.4 with the 64 bit operating system with a full package installation I install the operating system with a custom now option I will install all the package so that it will not uh, will not face any dependency problem in the future while installing Xcurt and the uh, partition details we need to maintain the root partition with uh, 18 GP because within this 80 GP this OS operating system package and XCAD package which will include uh, yeah, here I'll face lot of difficult to install XCAD because uh, with the I install the virtual box with the 10 GP hard disk but after while installing XCAD uh, I have to terminate that virtual box then I create once again with the virtual box with the root file system more than uh, 10 GB which is now I created with 18 GB and this install partition to create the OS imaging because OS imaging to cloning and to create the new disk everything it will take a lot of space so just for now for testing purpose I create 8 GB then remaining IP tables yes, Linux we need to disable and we need to maintain etc host proper update this is the second thing uh, and the third and the third point is we need to configure M uh, we need to configure M OS repo now I didn't configure OS repo because this OS repository it's already installed in the all the pack full installation then we need to configure XCAD core and XCAD dip 
this two package we can download it from this site if you go to this link from this link you will get the download link you can download the, now I'll download the latest version of XCAD 2.8.5 and uh, uh, their dependency also I, I already downloaded and uh, which is I, I put in the system here the top yeah here I, I already downloaded XCAD core 2.8.2 and uh, XCAD dependency both is already downloaded and I already extracted uh, XCAD core package is extracted into the XCAD core directory and XCAD dep zip file is extracted into the X XCAD dependency and this two repo is configured in etcm dot repository cat xcat dot core dot repo this is the file and uh, for dependency I have installed here so finally we configure the tomb repo list see here we have for xcat core it has 18 package xcat dip it has 13 package so now this is the log file of the system so what are the ops what are the things we are doing it will update here keep on updating so we can monitor what is going on background so now i am going to install the xcat it is looking for the package and dependency it is resolving keep on resolving or oh, some package due to the dependency it is failing so I think we need to configure uh, OS repository also